antenna. Big sky country. The treasure state. People got a lot of names for it. I just call it home. Lived here my whole life. Still amazed at how beautiful it is. Maybe that's what blinded us to how ugly the people were getting. You don't understand. No one took these groups seriously. They were different. Religious. Militant. I mean, it was a goddamn cult. The collapse is upon us, my children. They started buying up every farm for miles. Then the radio station. Not long after that, they even had the fucking cops. Their own sovereign religious state. Built right here. Under our noses. Ain't no one coming to help us. The government can't do shit. We're on our own. Friends, we save those lost souls, whether they want to be saved or not. People don't want to believe groups like this exist. People are scared, man. Some will wish to harm us. Some will wish to destroy all that we have built here together. Some will betray us. We don't know what he's capable of. Ow. Who? Their leader. Joseph Seed. They call him the Father. And those in the outside world are blind. They do not believe. They have no faith. But I will make them see.
Be in the church. Stick close. Eyes open. These folks can spoke easily. Rook, on me. Stay loose, huh? What are they doing here? Be calm. Stay calm, everyone. Just go about your business. This doesn't concern you. Sheriff, I don't like this. Everything's fine, Lassie. Everything's just fine. Jesus Christ. You're wearing badges, aren't you? Yeah, but they don't respect badges much out here. They'll respect a nine millimeter. Not every problem can be solved with a bullet, Marshal. We're looking for trouble. What are you doing? We don't want any of to get your name in the paper. You'll be fine. Something is coming. You can feel the pain. We are creeping toward the edge. And there will be a reckoning. That is why we started the project. Because we know what happens next. They will come. They will try to take from us, take our guns, take our freedom, take our faith. We will not let them. Sheriff, come on. Hold on, Marshall. We will not let their greed or their immorality or their depravity hurt us anymore. Sheriff, sure. there will be no more thing. suffering. Oh, fuck it. Joseph C. I have a warrant issued for your arrest on the suspicion of kidnapping with the intent to harm. Now, I want you to step forward and keep your hands where I can see them. There they are, the locusts in our garden. See, they've come for me. They've come to take me away from you. They've come to destroy all that we've built. Oh, do not touch that service with This moment would come. We've prepared for it. Go. Go. God will not let them take me. I saw when the Lamb opened the first seal, and I heard, as it were, the noise of thunder, one of the four beasts say, Come and see. Step forward. And I saw. And behold, it was a white horse. And hell followed with him. Rookie, cuff this son of a bitch. God will not let you take me. on him. Sometimes the best thing to do is to walk away. Let's go. Take point, go on right. On it. Stay on the path, rookie. Keep 
keep up. I am a federal marshal. I'm ordering you to stand back. Fine here. No need to call anyone. Yes, Father. Praise be to you. No one is coming to save you. unfolding according to God's plan. I'm still here with you. The first seal has been broken. The last has begun. But we will take what we need. And we will preserve what we have. And we will kill all those who stand in our way. These the harbingers of doom will see the truth. Begin the revenge! We gotta get out of here.
exactly as the father said it would. I saw it. They tried to kill him. They tried to kill the father. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Rook, I'm sorry. I thought they got you. Come on. Come on. Come on. Check the room, Rook. Oh, Jesus. I had no idea. Fuck. We're putting this whole family away. All of them. Fucking lunatics. We're gonna get out of this, rookie. First things first, gotta arm ourselves. Here. All right, here's what we're gonna do. There's a road out there. We're gonna take it, we're gonna head northeast. It's probably only a few hours back to Missoula, and then, we're gonna come back here with a goddamn National Guard, and we're gonna take out the rest of these. Okay, shh.
piece of dynamite in the back of the truck. Use it. Hurry! Take them out! You know what that shit means? It means the roads have all been closed. It means the phone lines have been cut. It means there's no signals getting in and out of this valley. But mostly it means we're all fucked. Goddamn collapse. They all think the world's coming to an end now. They've been waiting for it, for years. Waiting for somebody to, to come along and fulfill their prophecy and kick off their goddamn holy war. Well, you sure as shit kicked. <sighs> Smartest thing for me to do would just be to hand you over.
Get out of that uniform. We need to burn it. There's some fresh clothes there. When you get changed, you come and see me. We'll see if we can unfuck this situation. Can you hear me? This is Dutch. Come in. Over. Eli. One, two, one, two. One, two, one, two. This is Dutch. I didn't properly introduce myself back there. Most folks call me Dutch. I've been trying to piece together what's happening up top. It ain't good. Little I can gather is that your partners are alive. For now. Seems they've been split up. Each one handed off to a different member of Joseph's family. You want him back, I get it, I get it. I got friends that have been taken, too. Problem is, there ain't no help coming. Nobody knows what's going on here, and they won't know until it's too late. There's got to be people out there willing to fight back against this cult. We just, we need to show them how. We need to build us a resistance. So the first thing we're gonna do is get control of this island. Once we got some breathing room, we can figure out what's coming next. There's a gun and a map in the safe over there. Take them. I'll give you a call on your radio once you get your bearings. Be careful out there. It's crawling with Peggy's. Those fuckers are willing to die for that psychopath that's leading them. Fight, 
You can take on the cult outposts that have popped up across the county. Liberating those places will give the Resistance solid footholds to push back against Eden's Gate. I've got cameras set up all over this island. I'll keep an eye out for anything useful. For now, head south and take out any culture you see. And help any folks in need, would you? Dutch out. I guess this is what the project needs. You don't have to be a hero, but come on! Thanks, Deputy. <clears throat> These loony fanatics are out of control. If you want to protect yourself, I think there's a prepper stash near the boathouse. Should have some good gear squirreled away. You may want to build some dynamite. Luckily, folks around here have been stockpiling all the materials you might need. So just grab them up. Get crafting. Thank you. 
Seriously, thank you. Shit, kid. I just saw the cult grab a guy down by the docks. You help him out, and maybe he'd be willing to pick up a gun and return the favor. to lend a helping hand. Hey, Deputy. Now that you're partnered up, the two of you should head to the Forest Research Station. Ghosts been crawling all over that place, using it as a depot for their goddamn bliss. Clear them all out. Send a message. We're not fucking around anymore.
see over there. That was too close. There was a way to end this peacefully. Doesn't look like it. Though. Oh shit. Deputy, I'm picking up something new out of Holland Valley. It's a broadcast from John. 
You need to see this. We are all sinners. Every one of us. You, me. <laughs> Even the Father knows deeply of sin. It's a poison that clouds our minds. What if I told you you could be free from sin? What if I told you that everything you ever dreamed could come true? What if I told you that everything could be overcome if you embraced an idea? That freedom from sin can come from the power of just one word. to be unburdened. Yes, I must be redeemed. If you're watching this, know that you have been selected. You will be cleansed. You will confess your sins and you will be offered atonement. Don't worry. You don't have to do anything. We'll come for you. Welcome to Eden's Gate. Fuck. John C's got your partner, Hudson. She's in a world of shit, kid. You gotta get going. Hey, kid. I marked three locations to your map to get you started. Lumber Mill up north, the Hope County Jail to the east, and the town of Falls End to the west. Now it's your call, but if I were you, I'd start with Falls End. Gotta save us from Eaton's Gate. Uh, mister, have a second to talk? After the shit went down, I heard Merle took his truck over to Silver Lake Trailer Park. Dude can hold his own in the fight, but I'm worried he's gonna get in over his head. All you have to do is listen to Joseph! Bye bye, Deputy. Come on and play, tough guy! <laughs> 